In this section, we will learn about uh, two interesting features of Excel. One is autofill, and the second will be flash fill. So let us look at autofill first. Now, when we enter data into Excel, many a times it becomes a tedious task when it is a repetitive data. For example, let's say you are entering uh, some student data, or date wise, and uh, we enter the first date, first Jan 2015. Then it is second Jan 2015. And then it is 3rd Jan 2015. So it becomes a very tedious task, right? The other data, of course, can be, uh, may not have some uh, uh, some series or some sequence, but this definitely has a sequence. So is there some way to uh, reduce the effort that goes in entering the data? So we will use the autofill feature, which we actually have used, and most of you might be quite uh, well versed with this feature, but uh, may not be knowing that it is called the autofill feature. So there's a box which appears here, there's a cross that you can see, which you need to keep dragging down. And you can see the dates also increase accordingly. So it reduces the effort that goes in, in uh, entering the data manually. Let's see whether it goes on to February. It does. goes to March as well. So that actually saves a lot of time uh, when you are, especially when you are uh, manually entering data for students. This is called the autofill feature. Now let us look at the flash fill uh, feature. Going uh, to the, uh, the, the names data of the participant group here. Now we have the names here and uh, the surnames here. Kindly excuse me if this is not your surname. This is just an example. So I want these two to join. Okay, so I want this in the form of Trupti Gupta. Okay, both together. So I have just filled in one. And let's say I've got loads of data. I mean, I have hundreds of data below this as well. So I, I'm obviously not going to sit and uh, you know, manually enter this. So I use a feature called flash fill. There you are. If I want to really again break it down or if I have data like this, let's say I have data like Trupti Gupta and I want it to be split. There are two ways of doing it. I will show you the first way which is the flash fill method. The second method we will learn a little later. So how, how is it? So we have learnt autofill and flash fill here. 